fires John Galliano after a video goes viral, strobe lights, tanks, fashion lookbooks to the YouTube audience, and I show you how to organize your wardrobe in our Simply Genius segment. I'm your host, Katie Dufour, and welcome to this fashion flavored edition of The Socialite. Recently we had a look at the GoDaddy saga which showed the CEO of the company shooting dead an elephant. Now this was captured on video and the video went viral. Well the consequences of this video are yet to be found but Dior are living in the wake of a similar scandal but the consequences for them are all too real. Now the French fashion powerhouse had to fire its star studded designer John Galliano after a video of him surfaced showing him hurling racist abuse at people in a bar in Paris. Now after the video went viral this had a lot of consequences for Dior. Not only were they all but invisible at the recent Academy Awards which is rare for Dior on the red carpet, Natalie Portman who is the face of Dior Cherie denounced John Galliano's comments in a strongly worded statement disassociating herself from the designer. Now what we're seeing here is the magnitude of consequences for people in power. Social media has the amazing ability to spread content so quickly and to so many people it's not as easy to sweep under the rug anymore. When strobe lights recently surfaced on YouTube I was intrigued. Now essentially what strobe lights is is it's an online version of the traditional fashion photography lookbook. Now what it does is it takes a lookbook online, makes it interactive and brings it to the YouTube generation. Each video is a sub 60 second musical montage of a single look photo shoot edited together with a strobe motion photography technique giving the effective movement. Where it gets clever is the use of web video and social media stars as models based on the idea that their influencer status will have more impact with the online community. Hudson Media co-founded the project alongside fashion partners. Now what they want to do is move it out of the YouTube channel and into the social media platforms. Essentially what they want to achieve is a click to buy feature where you can click on the outfit and purchase all the pieces online. There's nothing more satisfying than a freshly organized wardrobe and this week's Simply Genius idea lets you do just that. The Stylebook app allows you to take pictures of each piece of your clothing and then clear cuts the image allowing you to layer the images to create an entire outfit. You can then take this outfit and put it in the calendar. The calendar lets you organize what you're going to wear and when you're going to wear it. Now what's even more handy is it has a log which lets you look back and see when you wore a specific outfit or piece of clothing, avoiding those awkward same person's party, same outfit you wore last time moments which I'm sure we've all had. Now in my opinion the $3.99 price tag is well worth it for this handy piece of fashion Easter technology. I hope you enjoyed this special fashion edition of The Socialite. For more social media news and tech happenings, check out our website, socialmedianz.com. Now I will be taking a short break as I'm off to Thailand to get a tan and drink some cocktails. I will be back the 3rd of May. Don't miss me too much. I'm your host, Katie Dufour. See you guys later.